<laughs> so should I like? Oh, my shoes are tied. <laughs> I'm not a a big prank person, so I had to really think back for the answer to this one. Our best attempt at a prank was pranking my teacher. We had finished an, a class early and we were waiting for our teacher to come. So like, let's hide upstairs. Someone had stayed downstairs and someone had dropped something while we were upstairs. So it was like, it, it flopped almost immediately. One time at summer camp, Gus and I participated in using bungee cords to tape a guy to his bed and then we carried his bed all the way up to the mess hall. So I haven't pulled pranks, but my friends do this a lot. One of my friends were in Westchester and they dressed up as like a mannequin, like just scared random people in the streets. This is actually probably the last prank I've ever pulled, like the most recent one and I was like seven. My friend was uh, at my house, and so we just decided to set like a ton of traps in our room, just basically booby trap, like our whole bedroom. I sometimes try to like scare my friends. I remember one time I scared Bryn, and she was like coming out of her room, and she like <laughs> fell over immediately, it was so funny. When I was working, we were introducing someone new, and there was this thing that me, and Ryle discovered that if you turn all the lights off on the second floor of Promise Kingdom, put a chair at the end of the hallway, and sit in that chair, it's pretty creepy. So what we did was as someone was being introduced to the new job, we were showing him the ropes. Ryle's sitting on that chair, hood up, very creepy like, and then he stands up and starts like hardcore crazy dude sprinting at us. Ken said, I had the time of my life. Um, oh, it's a tricky one. So I feel like my whole life, it's been hard for me to make friends, always going to public school. Someone always has something to say and I feel like public school is like a really interesting place. It's very clicky and if you're not the prettiest girl, like no one wants to be friends with you. Um, and then now that like my faith is really important to me, it's easy to be like, oh, she just loves Jesus. Like we're not gonna invite her to hang out with us. I um, mean, so I think it's just been harder for me to love people who don't really want me to be around them, but I'm not letting that stop me trying to love them the same way. The time when it was hardest for me to find friends was when I was in grade school, especially because at that time I was not necessarily looking for friendships in the church. I was trying to find those friendships in school because those were the people I was around the most, but it was difficult to find that friend group. It felt definitely like I was being pulled into someone I wasn't. New friends have been hard at our school. There's a kind of a click of basically half the school and it's like you're certain you either are in or you're out and some of the newer girls and guys that have come to the school have been able to be accepted into that click very very easily and when me and my classmates have tried I've found it hard to be closer with that person those people that have just easily clicked in and it's just kind of like you're accepted we're not in a way definitely the people like in public sports I played soccer last year and there's a bunch of kids on the soccer team that were um, there I mean they're not Christian so it makes myself different there's part of me that was like you don't need to be friends just just play soccer with them but they were different and I, I stood out because of that so you know it was okay but it was just it was difficult to relate with them it's been hard because I would say I was probably about 12 um, and I had two of my closest friends move away. I think it can be hard just in general to make new friends because we can have just like a fear of like, oh, what if they don't like me? Or um, I don't really know what to say. But so I think those are just small factors into making new friends. And, and so I think it's helpful to just forget about those things. Honestly, I feel like unless I'm forced into a situation where I like have to bond with someone or make new friends, it's always a little hard for me because I just tend to be more introverted, more shy. But I was lucky to you know, know some of my closest friends from like a really young age, basically as long as I can remember. I think just in general for me, it's just harder to make new friends just because of my tendency to be more introverted.